So Mary Ann, a lot of discussion tonight about uh, what's going to be moving forward sure. the, to the full city council regarding downtown parking. Tell us, uh, just kind of give us the bullet points of what is going to be changing. So um, the SISM committee tonight moved to approve two hours of free parking throughout the core of downtown. So that would be an expansion. Uh, First Street right now, or Third Street, excuse me, right now is one hour parking. So that would go to two hours. And then there actually would be two hours of free parking in the parking lots and the parking ramps. So there's gonna be a lot of opportunity for uh, more for free parking. And then they also um, made a motion to implement a graduated fine uh, schedule for repeat offenders. So right now we have probably the lowest parking tickets in uh, the state. We would have one courtesy ticket and then um, after that um, the fees would be $10 a piece for your second and third ticket and then it would go up from there and it would reset annually. So really trying to get uh, long-term parkers to park in a more uh, long-term space through kind of a carrot and a stick. And then one thing that uh, was brought up quite a bit tonight was you're going to try and move people now towards parking more in the in the downtown ramps, is that correct? Correct, yep, and we'll accomplish that, like I said, through the initial free parking, so they'll get two hours of free parking, and then the rates in the ramps will remain at 50 cents. Uh, the lots will go after the two hours of free parking to a dollar an hour. So um, it's still going to be really affordable. It'll be more affordable because there's more two hours of free parking spaces in the downtown. And um, hopefully we will make it more convenient with um, adding uh, pay stations. Our current meters only take change and we get a lot of feedback. I don't have change. So now you can use a cre- you'll be able to use a credit card or a dollar bill um, and the machine will be equipped to give you change. And then where do you know exactly yet where these stations are going to be posted? We do have the locations uh, mapped out. There could still be some tweaking. Our electrical department uh, took a look at all the locations to make sure that we could get the necessary power to them. But I think we've got it pretty well. Now, the goal is to make it convenient for people um, so that they don't have to walk far for the pay station. And, then, and those would be only for the lots and the ramps. Yeah. And then uh, as, as well with this, um, the implementation is going to come actually pretty quickly here. This is all going to be up and running by October, correct? We hope so. That's the goal is to have it up and running by October. And during um, that implementation, Our goal is to really concentrate on education. We are going to be developing a marketing and wayfinding plan in conjunction with this. And um, during the implementation, we'll really be focusing on education. And, you know, most of the tickets will be courtesy tickets with a pamphlet on the new parking rules so that everybody has ample time to get accustomed to the changes. And... uh then is there anything else we should need know about this? I mean, it's going to go to the full council by on next August fourteenth. Right? Yes, August fourteenth, and then from there, uh, if all goes as planned, October. Correct. Yes. All right. Anything else we should know about this then? Nope. I think that's it. All right.